Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. A couple of weeks ago, as I did post, Microsoft began testing widget button alerts in the bottom left of the taskbar with Windows 11 insiders in the insider program. Now, this is just a quick video just to keep you up to date as to a new development in that regard. And um, Microsoft have announced on the 16th of August, which was about two days or so ago in my region, that they are now rolling out and bringing you more live content on your taskbar to all Windows 11 uh, users now. So it's not just available to insiders. Um, all Windows 11 users will start seeing the new widget notifications appearing um, in the taskbar over the next couple of weeks. Now, as I did post, Microsoft mentions that the change allows you to see live updates from other widgets such as your sports widget, your uh, finance widget, and breaking news, just to mention a couple of examples. And your taskbar should show the weather most of the time, which is the default widget. But when something important happens related to one of your other widgets, Microsoft says you may see an announcement from that widget on your taskbar. Now, um, they also mention these announcements are meant to be quick and glanceable. And if you don't interact with them, the taskbar will return to showing you the weather, which, as mentioned, is the default widget. And the announcements, by the way, aren't any notification like that's audible, like a, 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 a little notification bell or anything like that. They will just show up and your, your widget will just change to a stock widget or a finance widget or uh, a breaking news widget, just to mention a couple of examples. Now, um, to get this updated feature, Microsoft mentions you should head over to the Microsoft Store and update the Windows Web Experience Pack from the store. And um, if we just head to the store, um, I did update my Web Experience Pack, which, by the way, if in case you are unaware, is a default feature of Windows 11. And what it does is uh, it's a feature that powers Windows widgets and enables widget notifications on the taskbar. So that's what the Web Experience Pack is all about. And um, if you aren't seeing the update, um, I updated mine um, on the 16th when Microsoft did make that announcement. You can always just check and get updates and that will update any outdated apps, apps in your store to the latest version. And um, that will then upgrade you to the latest version of the Windows Web Experience Pack, which is needed to start seeing that live content on your taskbar. Now, uh, it's important to note, though, um, as in my case, if you have the latest version of Windows, but still don't see all wind widget features appearing in the uh, taskbar um, on your Windows 11 operating system, Microsoft says it's because some features are being rolled out over several weeks and aren't available to all customers at once. So even if you have upgraded to the latest uh, web experience pack and you aren't seeing it like I am not in my case and um, just be patient um, as it is on a controlled rollout and you should be seeing that um, those new widget notifications showing up over the next couple of weeks if your web experience pack has been upgraded to the latest version. Now I'm um, just on a side note and um, these notifications by the way you cannot turn them off so the only way you can so-called turn the notifications off if it is distracting is just to head over to your taskbar settings in Windows 11 and you will have to turn off and disable the widget completely by just unchecking and toggling that off uh, in your taskbar personalization page in your settings and that will be the only way at this stage you, you will be able to turn off those notifications um, because there is no way to turn off the widget notifications when that feature does roll out to you. But I just wanted to let you know that those widget notifications now are becoming more widely available according to Microsoft. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.